now let us try to see this example this one uh, is from the previous previous video so we'll be doing this one first then we will do that one so here in this case we have s derives a a slash a slash b b slash c c a can derive a b b can derive a slash a a c can derive c c d and d can derive d d d okay so the first step is find all the useful productions so what are the useful production the production which are directly generating a terminal so here uh, start symbol is always useful obviously so d is directly generating a terminal so d is a useful production b is generating a terminal so b is a useful production so is there any right hand side which is made up of this c when we say useful symbols then all the terminals are always useful all the terminals are always useful so here we have the terminals which are small a so b small c and small d small a b small c and small d these are the these are always useful in any case this will always be useful right so here is there any right hand side which is made up of only this so a drives small a b so this is made up of small a and b so this is also useful so capital a is also useful so is there any right uh, right hand side which, which is only made up of this uh, d is proven to be useful b is useful a is useful and s is useful because s is also directly generating small a so these are the useful symbols right and uh, right so here we know small c is not useful sorry small c is useful but capital c is not at all useful right so all the symbols which are proven to be useful we are going to use it and those symbols which are not proven to be useful we are going to remove it for example we are going to remove this one so any reference to c remove that one so we are going to remove it hence we are going to get something like this s can derive a a slash small a slash b b a can derive a b b can derive small a slash a and capital d can drive d d d now find all the productions which are not uh, reachable from the start symbol here d is not reachable from the start symbol therefore we are going to remove this one also so we are going to get this grammar and this grammar all the productions are useful okay all the productions are useful so uh, this is the minimized grammar in this case okay now take this example first of all find all the symbols which are useful see again i am telling you all the all the you know terminals are always useful so here we have terminal small a and small b small a and small b are also always useful so this is a generating directly generating small a therefore a is also useful start symbol is always useful and is there any production which is made up of this d is generating a b therefore d is always useful d is also useful e is directly generating a terminal d is a small d is a terminal therefore e is also useful e is also useful anything which is made up of a combination of this we have b generating bb it is not useful because b is not proven to be useful till now and uh, d is proven to be useful e is useful a is useful and s is useful these are the useful productions so this production is not at all useful so any reference to this delete them so after removing this reference we are going to get s derives a a a derives a a slash a and d derives a b slash a a and e derives a c slash d now now remove the productions which are unreachable from the start symbols from the start state we cannot reach d as well as we cannot reach e therefore this complete grammar can also be uh, represented like s derives a a and a derives a a slash a so this complete grammar can be represented by these two productions only okay so uh, we can take more examples but i think this much this much examples are enough so see whenever you want to re, uh, you know uh, minimize any given grammar to minimize any given grammar we have to follow all these three steps so uh, you have to identify when do we have to remove all the use, useless symbol you have to remove all the unit productions you have to remove all the 
uh, epsilon productions because those productions are not at all useful uh, they are not generating they are not doing actually effective work so whenever you want to minimize a grammar you have to take help of all these three techniques and with the help of all these three you can minimize a given grammar okay